Hello, I'm Edward and welcome to WindowsReport.com. In this video, I will show you what to do when the autorun.in file is missing or corrupt. An autorun.in file is a text file that can be used by the autorun and autoplay components of Microsoft Windows operating system. When this type of file is missing or becomes corrupt, it can be a bit tricky to solve unless you know the exact steps to make. So let's take a look at how to solve this problem in no time. For a more detailed explanation and even more solutions, please check the article in the description below. The first solution is running the program in compatibility mode. To do that, you have to locate the program's icon, right-click on it and select Properties. Then click on the Compatibility tab. Afterwards, check the box Run this program in compatibility mode for and select the desired Windows version. Then click OK and try to run the program again. This is a pretty simple solution and it should help you if you're getting the autorun in file is missing or corrupt error while trying to run older software. Another useful solution is using command line. Firstly, you have to copy the usmoney dlx sunset.exe into your documents folder. Next, click the start button in the lower left corner and simply type cmd to open command prompt. Then run command prompt as administrator. Afterwards, enter the following commands and press enter. These commands should fix the issue, so make sure you try again to run the program. Some users also reported that using myinst instead of setup command worked for them, so be sure to try both commands. You can also rename the registry key. To do that, press the start button in the lower left corner and simply type regedit. Then click Registry Editor. Afterwards, you have to navigate to the following path. Then in this specific path, you have to right-click the autorun.inf key and then choose Rename. Then rename the key to autorun.inf.bak and run the program again and it should work now. Finally, you can return and change the registry name to its initial name. And you can also delete the autorun inf key, but it would be safer to just rename it. After renaming or deleting this key, check if the autorun.in file is missing or corrupt message is gone. And lastly, you can also create the autorun.in registry key. To do that, press the start button in the lower left corner and simply type regedit. Then click registry editor. Afterwards, you have to navigate to the following path. Then right-click the INI file mapping and select New. Now choose Key from the context menu. Then name the new key autorun.inf. This solution can fix the autorun in file missing, but the solution only works if you don't have the autorun.inf key in your registry. To do that, just follow the steps that I just mentioned and check if that solves the issue. For more information and details, please check the article in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.